Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Let's Play Fortress Craft Evolved again, and I'm here with Togi. I'm so annoying. Yes, always. And um, I think today, uh, I don't know what Togi's up to, but uh, I'll probably wait, not... Wait, wait, wait. What? Why are the PCBs coming out onto the coal thing? Oh. Because that's sitting there. <laughs> that's slightly annoying. <gasps> Do you realize, though... It's going to be burning the PCBs. It actually burns them? Um, we need to set this to... Add only. There you go. <laughs> um, well, the description of this is convert the most efficient resources from your added inventory when you press add. So it says efficient. Like It sounded like it can burn anything as long as, you know, I don't know. It's still doing it? <laughs> yep. It says add only though. Still doing it. I guess we just have to redo this part here, that's all. But still, that's crazy. Here I was just going to have a little corner, but he wants to make it more of a perfect angle because he'll drive him insane, I guess. Yes. What? What? <laughs> what? Why? Because I'm friggin' psychopath. Great. <laughs> well, it was good you caught that, anyways. <laughs> okay, so we got those, and then we need tin plates here. Oh, yeah. And I'm probably gonna need more. How many tin do I have on me? 8k, 800. 8k, I wish. 8K. <laughs> uh, we'll put, we're gonna do this again because I feel like we're gonna use more of these over time, anyways. And then I'll start putting these into the chests over here, or the hoppers to process. Um, not harden, primary, I guess it was called. <laughs> I just what? realized what I just said. I said it wasn't hardened, it was primary. <laughs> PCBs. Never mind. Um, you suck. What does this word clearing over time mean? The what word? I always once in a while see the word clearing. I don't know, I must be crazy. Okay, so um, with that going, uh, these will drain incredibly fast, like we know, sadly. And when we get attacked, we probably will have no turrets protecting us because all this power is gone. Um, but this should make us simplified experiment pods, which we need. But we don't need just those ones. We still need the other ones as well. Uh, but we only need five basic ones, which the good news is I think I have them in my inventory somewhere. The good news is, I do. N oh, yeah, there they are. Basic. And so now we just need the simplified ones. Unfortunately, we just ran out. Oh, I guess you can run through the basics and then the simplified. It doesn't have to run at once. So we need to start making new power. So I'm going to start a power thing today. Maybe I shouldn't keep hitting the bind, huh, Togi? You probably were talking to. Hey, it's up to you. I'm, I'm, no, I'm not talking. I'm just digging. Oh. So I'm letting people listen to you. I guess I can keep Maybe talking. Maybe they like your voice. Oh. But it's your channel. You're supposed to talk once in a while. Hey, guys. Uh, listen to Kane talking. He <laughs> knows what he's talking about. Oh. That's better talking than saying about. he, you know, I have no room to talk because he's always talking. Hey, guys. King's talking again, so <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I wonder if there's a way to control... And no. To like mass place down uh, conveyors. Because if you try to control uh, like on the side um, of the block, they flip them up in the air. Oh. There's probably a way. 
Oh, you know what? I think a year ago plus, like last time I played, I think he was making a device that actually places conveyors for you. It was like a robot or something. And if it was a year ago, presumably he's done it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're smarter than you, you know, make it sound. Or something. What? Well, now I'm not smart. <laughs> so, hey guys, don't listen to Kane anymore. He's oh. not. At there's that point, no, there, there's no materials at this level. There probably is. Are you pinging known ores instead of unknown ores? No, nope, unknown. I'm pretty sure titanium would be at that level. What, 200? Shouldn't it be 300? Well, yeah, actually, the cold cavern could go really deep. I don't know. But I assume it would be at the cold cavern level, no? Because something would be. Well, maybe just crystals then. I don't know. There we go. And we're going to check out... Oh, yeah, so our last attack. Uh, 52 kills, 6,200 power. So it wasn't bad, but definitely uses up quite a bit of power over time. We're going to quickly take a break here, and we're going to check out what Togi's been doing here. Oh, he's oh. cleaned up a bit. I did some no nor, and there's plenty of that, but no unknown. So we got a good deed from that. So this is the what is it called? A cold cavern? Oh, yes. there's a, there's a dead body sitting here. It's that's mine. I was two feet away from the entrance. <laughs> I haven't died in here. Oh, okay. So, so that was, was me. Yeah. So this is the cold cavern. Um, we're like a couple feet good. If uh, if you go down here, watch my suit level. It will start to right here. Oh yeah, there it goes. But Arthur kind of keeps up to you, but I don't want to waste all his power. Um, but in the cold cavern, it's pretty uh, dangerous. What is that? What? What the? Did I do that accidentally? Do what? There's. Oh. What are they? Those look like they're. You see them, right? Uh, I do see them. It says it's deep stone. You see the thing floating there? Oh, maybe mine's different. Mine shows like a template or something. Like a looks like a a picture with a glass on it or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a big square. Yeah, yeah. That's like what thing. some of those blueprints look like. You know, the ones that they, like then they're, they're not interactive though. Yeah, I'm placing rocks on top of them. It's just a glitch or something weird. Oh, cool! You put a little bunch of lights here. I don't know if I can still find my way though, so who might us? <laughs> yeah, it looks like this is all crystal. Hey, you know, a lot of people would die for some crystals, anyway. So, all right, you need even more lights for this. You know what? I died down here once. I know. I can see your body to remind us. Oh! This part is fun. Oh no, that part wasn't fun. What is this, Togi? Hey, it's iron, so don't complain. No, 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 like, you should fill, like, make it so we can not fall through the, uh... Fine. There we go. Whoa! <laughs> I was trying to slingshot myself up, and then finally I did it, but it was like 15, 20 blocks in the air. It's like, woo! Okay, so these are starting to fill up. So I'm going to do something kind of unique, I think. Um, I don't know how people make power generation usually in this game, but I think I have a cool idea that will work. Crafting. Wow, I have 1,500 copper on me. Ooh, I just hit achievement progress, 1,400 out of 10,000 crafted items. Oh, actually, hmm. What kind of stone do you need, Togi? For what? Uh, oh, that's resin, ew. Oh, bedrock. Uh, do you need uh, lots of concrete wall over time? I need all stone. 
crafting, crafting. Because it's all useful crafting. in making stuff. I don't think I saw the progress come up. Does control click not count as crafting? Or not? Hmm. I just crafted like a thousand plus and the achievement progress didn't pop up saying, you know, you've done an extra 500 or a thousand to the crafting. Anyways, these are filling up with coal. And then what we're going to do is we're going to place generators all around them. This is going to be the crazy part of it. Crazy. Uh, the coal that's going to the main power hub, not much of it. Um, we mean not much of it. Come, come further up towards where the miner is. It is all empty here. Well, let's see how much is left. It probably isn't that bad. It looks pretty solid to me. There's still 89,000 there. No, 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 but like, it's mining it, but it's not mining it fast enough. Look, the oh, no, 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 be because we, we ended up accidentally draining it because of this container, remember? Oh, is that container getting... Yeah, it's just five free cool. slots. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, I just hit 19,000 out of 1 million ore that we have to do. That's our goal, Togi. We cannot quit till we hit that. Oh, a million ore? Yeah, that's actually not a lot, because if you think about it, some no, of those... No, I was going to say, it's, yeah. it's exponential. Yeah. Okay, so, do you see what I'm doing here, Togi? I'm doing crazy stuff. Are you putting your tractors down? No. Oh, oh more power. I have to put these in here temporary so I can put it f fancier looking, but it's going to be a lot more power actually. It's going to be like this. Do you want some nice concrete wall blo floor blocks? Uh, you can redecorate it after actually. I suck at decorating. I actually have to break those open again um, because what's going to go in there is actually energy cells. It's a, it's a, it's basically like uh, a boring machine in a sense. I know it sounds weird, but the idea is that the energy is going to be passed through the entire thing and they're going to be kind of connected. That's kind of cool. Probably overdoing the thickness of it, but I mean, it looks badass and it's gonna provide us layouts and layouts of PO. So let's see what our threat level is right now since we're doing this. Our threat level, oh, it's only 238, so I don't guess, I guess it's not increasing much, but it might increase over time. I'm gonna need more of these. Does it look any better? Hold on a second, I'm almost done here. Why aren't you using tier 2 ones? Uh, because I don't really need tier 2 for this as much. Not yet, anyways. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty cool. It's fancy looking. Okay, so what are we doing with all that power? Well, we put lasers off of it. Yep. So, and we're gonna have them beam. That's weird. Oh, here they are. That's weird. I guess you can. Yeah, that's how you do it. It's like you can't apparently do this. It's uncapable of doing it. Uncapable. Yeah, it's a new word I made. I, I'm tired of the English language. It failed me too much. Uh, it's specifically for the research. Thing. It, it, it could be used for other things too, but like, yeah, that's kind of the Crafting. the idea here. Crafting. It's just one big ass power generation system. Ah, oh, what the heck? I just fell down. There you go.
there's a, a bit more than just the research that can oh crap did I oh no I'm on a different page here that's why that's kind of why I didn't want to waste the other ones on this because I felt like it's not needed for that but isn't that badass looking so that's like one big huge power generator uh so I guess it does um, 8, uh, 12, so it does 120 power a second. Nice. Now this only outputs at 90, so <laughs> if we hit Q on all these and reset them, it'll be about, it'll, it'll all be at about 10-ish. Well, I mean, you know, it's still not enough to power this fully, but at least it's better than nothing. Oh, you could not. The, the way it sounds like, the only way you could ever power this fully would be to have, like, probably, like, a thousand plus, and even then it probably can't. He made it sound like it would be really hard. Oh. <laughs> just watching how slow it is is funny. It's just like, Wow. Just like watching the timer on the basic experimental pod is just like, watch that paint dry, brother. Where is the timer on it? Um, like I'm in, inside, but yeah, at the basic experimental pod, it there, there's a little like, oh okay, yeah, slightly darker. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Back let's, to the shaft. Let's see. Primary. Oh yeah, here it is. Simplified, so we can place this on. And we'll put this in one of these. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'll put it here. And this cold research, I think, is important because I think it'll let us build ourselves a heat upgrade or something like that. And if that's the case, woohoo! It'll be a bit hotter in here. Looks like we're getting another attack, of course. See, my my thing, Togi, is I would love to have... I, I really hope the next power upgrade, like, for the lines, isn't, like, goes to 10 to, like, 15 or 20 to troll us, but, like, is actually, like, 100 or something. Because... Uh, no, I feel like it'll still be small. Ugh. Because I feel like we're going to end up having, like, 50 friggin' transmission lines going down, for example. <laughs> you know what I mean? Cause every yeah, that could be a pain. Yeah, that's... Like, it gets if it gets to that point, even getting the best lenses isn't going to help too much. I mean, the best lens in the game, well, at least what we've seen, which I have a feeling it might be, is 250%. I think there's more crystal lenses maybe later that you can get. I'm not sure. But I have a feeling the exceptional organic lens is going to be the best lens in the game, only based on the fact that he probably didn't put that too much behind a wall. Basically, once we researched that organic stuff, it was like, here you go. Oh, I found another hive. Not hive, like the, the underground ones. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they're considered hives too, though. I'm not sure, though, to be honest. Mini hive. Mini hive. Good. So the turrets are keeping up just fine. I feel bad, though. We should probably restart our entire game. That wow. one time we lost the thing. <laughs> oh. I mean, that, that draw, that's like that OCD thing, right? It kind of drives me the wrong way every time I think about it. And it shows on the thing, too. It's like, you've failed one wave or something like that. Oh. Don't worry, I'm sure I will make us fail more. <laughs> so. Oh, no! <laughs> that's what you get. I made it, though. Fair play. Oh. 
So Togi's searching for ore. I should do it for him. Watch I get it right away. Uh, I'm standing where we placed all those torches and my device, I can't see it. The ore device. scanner, because it's so much glow effect to it that, like, Holy open it up. How much did you put down? Not that much. Jeez. Right, there's ore. See this right next to it? Yeah. This block here is crystal ore. Oh. I don't need that. Not right now, anyways. But you might eventually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So run some power down here. Or later. No, no, you said run some power down here. Oh, man. It actually would be nice for you, probably. You'd use the power down here. Yes. Except you should run the power from the new thing there. Do you want me to do something about that, or will you take care of it? What do you mean, do something about it? Uh, you know there's the uh, coal there? Right yeah. here? That's where you should. That's the power you should be running down there. Oh, okay, yeah. I hate this part. Wee! Oh, wow, friggin'! <laughs> I always Quite fail high. at getting up that last piece, and then I get launched a million miles up. Let's see what our threat level is. So our threat level is 448. We've doubled our threat because of this new power. Nice. Yeah, so basically if you really increase your power usage, I guess, you know, <laughs> prepare. Oh, it's not even all running because the coal, I guess, gets shot to the next ones before they fill up. Once this thing fills up, they'll be all running, but... Nice. And then the next episode, we'll probably have the cold research done, and then we can see what that makes us. It'll probably make us some new recipes to hopefully explore the caverns, and then we can do just like a whole episode of going down there and exploring, I think, which would be awesome. And then by then, Togi will probably have a bit of uh, power going down there, too. How far are we in the episode, anyway? Uh, we're 22 minutes already. Oh, we got time. Time for what? <laughs> power. Oh, power. I should put some of these materials in here. So I'm starting to get pristine stingers. I don't know if you notice how I or organize them, but I have them organized as uh, ruin to um, like whatever it's called. Ruin to pristine and then uh, perfect or whatever. Oh wait, how did? Yeah, something happened. This entire thing shifted. It does it randomly. I don't know why. Everything seems to move at random. That sucks. It's all your efforts to make it all look good. Worth yeah. Nothing. Well, I could fix it up anyways, but it's just weird that you know. Most of it is still there. It's just like, it seems like some columns had shifted or something. It's kind of weird. Are you low on materials? So oh, let me... F I just keep filling them. I don't even bother filling it all completely. I just keep filling it up with, you know... There. Made everything four stacks in there. I don't think we have room to place my uh, 800 plus uh, lithium. I actually got 1300 uh, copper in my inventory, but there's 400 in the chest. So I guess the copper won't be an issue. I need hoppers, I think. Now, mathematically, those things last, I think, uh, 60 seconds on a burn, the generators. Oh, by the way, oh, efficiency is 100 right here, good. Um, so they last 60, right, Togi? So basically, that's those th two there are enough to produce uh, for eight generators. Wow. So okay, I'm, we don't need eight. I'm looking forward to the eight. Well, you say we don't need eight, but you must be new. Not yet. <laughs> okay. 
Honestly, you might want to not put it here, but rather put it over here in the wall or one of the sides of the walls and then because that way it's not going to be like protruding outwards like all our other caves. <laughs> Yeah, but doesn't the miner have to be on the coal? Yeah, anywhere on the coal, but you could do it back here on the side. I just meant just don't do it right here on the front because then it'll look kind of like it'll hang out, right? And then yeah, you're likes hanging out. Oh. I think that wave is done. Let's see what we're up to. Last kill, 41, 5200 power. That's weird, that was less. I guess it's random and stuff. They came from this side, so let's see if we got any loot. Yes, organic remains, spoiled one. Oh, one pristine light chitin. Chitin? Chitin? I don't know how to say that word. I never did. Chitin? Some people call it chitin, some people call it chitin. Oh my. Oh yeah, the lettering's back on our base. I wonder what if that has any meaning or if that just happens on like the peak sun or something. It does those like holographic lettering or whatever. How do you give power to a machine again? It says when you hover over it, is it T or something? Oh, okay, you can't give it directly to those things. Never mind. Which ones? The ore ones? Yeah, the ore miners. Yeah, open them. The interface you can. Hit E. You know they have an interface, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you can't, like, do it with the button. Oh, no, 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 yeah. Because I just got to get this one going, and then it will power itself, really. Yeah, pretty much. So we'll have another attack in three minutes. <laughs> Not that spe anything special anymore. Are these last ones? Oh, they're starting to boot up now. Oh, nice. I'll reset these lasers now and see if they show up as 10. Oh nice, we only have five simplified left to go, so it actually did it pretty fast. Compared to that other one, I don't know if we were supposed to do that, uh, the alien one right away. Like, I, I feel like that, that came later on in the game, right? And so I think that research was considered a lot harder and longer in time-wise, but uh, we ended up researching it a lot earlier than, you know, maybe that was planned. I wonder if, uh, I never actually checked, oh here it is, I, I never looked at those new recipes. So the laser resin obliterator, ablator, ablator? How do you spell obliterator? It's not how you spell obliterator. O, o B L I E yeah. something like that. This is like ablator, A-B-L-A-T-O-R. <laughs> okay. Uh, use a large amount of energy to ablate. A blade on the surface of a hardened resin, allowing it to liquefy. So, yeah, we've already talked about that, but th there's an unknown material required for all of it, including one of them requires 64 crystal deposits. Oh, I guess we'll need to be mining crystal at some point then. Oh, that's that mesh weave. What the hell is that mesh weave for? Mesh weave, you ready for this? This, isn't, this doesn't even make sense. It's expensive as hell. Requires eight generators, eight ore extractor, 64 crystal deposits, and 16 refined liquid resin for mesh weaver. And it looks wow. like it looks like just a mesh. That doesn't even make sense. What's the generators for? Like <laughs> what the frick? It must be something important. Maybe it's a machine. Maybe like like it sounds like it's just a mesh, like weaving mesh or something, but maybe it's something different than that. I don't know. Oh, there's oh, there's a item we can craft. Crafting. Now called a hardened resin detector. Oh, we know where hardened resin is. 
How far are you when you're hearing that? I am 109 down. Oh, it's an I actual. I wonder if it just plays anyway. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if it's a. Oh, it's a big ass block. What the frick? Hardened resin detector provides essentially an early warning system for approaching hive mines. Provides an early warning report nearby growing hardened resin clusters. Does not need power. Just check on it once in a while. You have enough resources to craft this. While I'm, while I'm looking at it, it's like you have enough resources to craft this. <laughs> oh, it's like pointing to the ground and doing some like crazy stuff. What the? It's very fancy looking. No interface, though. Huh. Maybe it's just pointing to one. Oh, yeah, it's pointing towards one. If I hit K, I see the red there. Oh, wow, that's really close to our base. So it'll tell us if they grow too or something? That's neat. What other recipes do we have? I, I made the Arthur turret. I've never really tried it yet. Basically, you just... You remember the charger, Togi? The Arthur charging station? It just works yeah. like that, and you click it, and he just basically mounts to it. Oh, what? To uh, get, arm, uh, get ammo? Uh, no, no. Like, he becomes an actual turret that's on the ground. Oh, okay. You know what's sad? They show titanium bars and nickel bars. That should be unknown now I think about it. We've never researched or found those. I'm just looking at the MK2 laser that says nickel and titanium. I'm like, well, but, but we, we've never actually seen those. <laughs> it's not playing by the rules. Oh, here's a basic matter remover. We talked about this before, didn't we? Oh, yeah. We can make those now, I guess. I guess we couldn't have made it for a while. We just forgot about it. Um, beams resources from attached storage chopper to another. Oh yeah, up to 64 meters away. Requires line of sight. I wonder how power hungry it is. Like, <laughs> we'll have to Google that one later. Wonder if it's in our book here. Holy crap! It can transfer up to 300 items per minute, 64 power per item. <laughs> Ooh, I don't think we should be using that. Maximum power transfer rate is 256 a second per face. Power capacity 512. Wow, that would actually be really cool, like eventually to have enough power to like have those running around. Yeah, we've got a while to go for that. Oh good, there's the first wave. I wanna place the Arthur thing here so we can see how it works. There he goes. Arthur's docking now, powering up. Well, you've done a fine job, Arthur, of killing things. They're just all full Oh, there he goes. What the Oh my goodness. He shoots one way. He doesn't look like he's hitting anything. And he uses 60 plus power. What percent power? I don't get this. <laughs> okay, so Togi, this Arthur thing, don't ever use it. Terrible. He's just randomly shooting in one direction. He's yet to hit anything from what I can tell. And... Oh, it says he's got one kill. What? Oh, so he's shooting at something. Maybe we just can't see the damage he's doing then, huh?
I think maybe he's just not properly synced up or something, but it doesn't even work for me properly. But like, it looks like he's shooting to the stars in a way. Oh, now he's shooting that way. Whoa. 3,000 or no, 3 million. Oh, so I'm up to 3 million power generated. What, total? Uh, yeah, I guess, um, have generated in total. Nice. Anyways, I guess we should wrap this up, huh? Uh, yeah, come, come down here and see, see what I've started. With the power. How far down? It's got all the way to the bottom. Oh, wow, that looks kind of fancy. Oh, crap. More hitting the wall. Stand this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just see how it bounced? It's like, whoa! So we have power. Nice. That'll be handy once we do our little exploration, once we get that cold research or yeah. whatever. Yeah, it's a pain in the ass to have to keep going up to get more power. Now, is this set to the side where... Oh, yeah, this is the main... Because we're going to keep going down, right, technically? Yeah, yeah, eventually. Yeah. So yeah, it is. It's within outside of the three. Sweet. That looks pretty cool. Let's see if I can make it all the way up here. Oh! Did you fall? No, no. I went crazy. Oh. Uh, I want to do something like really stupid, but. It's hard with the stuff in the way. I wanted to see if I could push back, grab further away, and then like launch myself like 100 feet in the air. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, guys and girls, thank you so much for watching. Um, how did this go? Oh, we did the cold research. I guess I could collect the research just for fun. Let's check the research here. One recipe, a suit heater MK1. Research. And then we go to suit upgrades, I guess. And there you go. It just requires some of the basic materials. Increase the suit heat power, protecting you from extreme cold. Only one required, blah, blah, blah. And there we oh, go. Oh, nice. And it's got a use for lithium. Oh, my goodness. Togi, it, we use 0 0.1 power now on the surface. Do you mean 0 0.1? Like, it doesn't just protect us from the cold cave. We're using no power up on the surface because it keeps oh, us... Oh, nice. Yeah, a lot warmer everywhere. Oh, that's awesome. So next episode, I guess we'll do some exploring. Thank you guys yes. and girls so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see you wonderful people next time. See you later, guys.